Ok, así. Así, 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 así. Good morning, good morning, and again I say good morning. This is the glorious day that the Lord hath made. It is a glorious day for us to rejoice and to be glad that we are alive and well. I have not seen, ear have not heard, neither hath it entered to the hearts of men the things that God has prepared for them that love him. My simple question to you this morning is do you really, do you really love him? Do you walk up close and intimate and personal with him? He'll walk as, God will walk as close to you as you let him. God will walk as, close, walk as close to you as you want him to. Do you really love him this morning on, on this September the 22nd, 2024? God has smiled on us and God has been good to us and God has been gracious to us. God has been kind unto us. He didn't have to do it, but he did. And for this eternal day, this, this eternal moment, we say, God, we thank, we thank you. Let's pray. God, our Father, we thank you for this another day that you have made. We rejoice. We are glad to be, to be alive and well. You show your goodness. Surely your mercy has followed us all the days of our lives as we continue to dwell in your house. We have called upon you in the past, and you have answered us, and you have shown us great and mighty things that we know not of. That I have, your, I have not seen, you have not heard, neither have entered the hearts of men the things that you have prepared for us simply because we love you. Now, Father, I pray again, not by might, nor by power, but by your spirit, saith the Lord. I pray that you would move this vesture of clay, this lump of clay, that your Holy Spirit would rest, rule, and abide and sit upon this lump of clay, that he, this lump of clay will be used to speak your word, to bring glory and honor unto your name, and to be a blessing of, to your people. To forgive, cleanse, and bless is our prayer in Jesus' name. Amen. Again, we thank Pastor Turner, Pastor Turner, First Family Turner of the Turners to, for this opportunity to again stand in this, in this sacred house, in this sacred place, and to again to teach God's, God's word. And then again, a shout out also to Pastor Jennings and Sister Janice Jennings down there in Austin, the, the hot town of Austin, Austin, Texas. From the book of Daniel, from the book of Daniel, from the prophetic book of Daniel, chapter 9, verses 9 through 14. I beheld till the thrones were cast down and the Ancient of Days did sit, 
whose garment was white as snow, and the hair of his head like, like the pure wool. His throne was like the fiery flame, and his wheels as burning fire. A fiery stream issued and came forth from before him. Thousands, thousands, thousands ministered unto him. The ten thousands, ten thousands stood before him. The, the, ju the judgment was set, and the books were opened. I beheld, then because of the voice of the great words which the horn spake, I beheld even the till the, till the beast was slain and his body was destroyed and given to, and given to the burning fire. As concerning the rest of the beasts, that they, they had their dominion taken away, yet their lives were prolonged for a season and a time. I saw, Daniel, I, Daniel saw in, in the night visions, and behold, one of the son of man is coming to come with the clouds of heaven and, come, and came to the ancient of days and brought him near, be, be, brought him near before him. And there was given him dominion and glory and kingdom that, that all people, nations, and languages should serve him. His dominion is, everlast, is an everlasting dominion which shall not be taken away and his kingdom that shall not be destroyed. It will last. It will last forever and ever. And the word is called, it will last into eternity. Some background. Some background for this morning's lesson taken from Daniel chapter 9, verses 9 through 14. Some background. The first, the, first half of the, the first half of the book of Daniel consists largely of stories about Daniel and his, and his friends' faithfulness in, in Babylon. The book opened with Daniel and his three friends refusing, refusing the royal menu, uh, this refusing the royal steak and eggs, refusing the, refusing the royal chocolate cake, ref refusing, the, uh, honoring their choice, honoring their decision, God honoring their choice and God honoring their decision. God blessed them with the help with health that was, when, of the royal, that was better than the royal food that the others had eaten. In chapter three, Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego uh, got in trouble and, and, were, and, were, and were going to get in trouble and, and refused to bow before the king's golden image and were, and, and, were, and were rescued by God from a king, from the king's fiery wrath, of, from the wrath of a fiery furnace. In chapter four, King Nebuchadnezzar was humbled. Ever been, ever been, Humbled, and he repented, and 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 and, and worship. That 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 that's the key right there. That when, whenever God has to humble you, He expects you to repent and 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 and, and to change your mindset and, and come and worship Him. In chapter five, in chapter five, now 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 King Belshazzar, Belshazzar saw a hand writing on the wall. This is one of my favorite scriptures. Saw the hand writing on the wall. Imagine imagine you're at this party and 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 and, and you and you're having a good time, and all of a sudden you look up and there's a hand. On the wall, only and and, and 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 you don't and you don't know what to think and you don't know what to say and you don't you don't even know what to do. It says that so Bel, Bel, Bel says I was was so was so nervous that his knees his knees started to buckle and only Daniel could interpret the writing that 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 would reveal that Babylon would fall. He would Babylon would fall between the Medes and the Persian and even and even under when even under even under Persian rule Daniel still. Daniel still was prosperous, and Daniel was still blessed, and Daniel still had still still had a prominent role. God still gave Daniel a bless the blessing of, of being on top. Some somehow so somehow so, but but there was, but there's some folks who did not like Daniel, and because they, they liked Daniel, they they trick, trick Darius into in their, in, in their writing a rule that says you can't you can't pray, and 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 and, and Daniel kept on praying, and he they, they, and they caught Daniel one morning praying praying in this. Praying in, the, in praying in his in his window, he wasn't hiding it. He was he was right up front with us. Dan, Daniel got out and, and prayed, and, and he tricked it. And, and but and, and and Daniel ended up being thrown into the lion's den. You ever been thrown into a proverbial lion's den? Yeah, leave that alone. That's in chapter six. In in in, in, in chapter seven, the book the book shifts though. It, it shifts from historical narrative stories to Daniel's apoc apocalyptic vision. Apocalyptic, a pop, prophet, prophetic, prophetic foreshadowing, prophetic seeing what, what is what is the, what's going to happen in advance. It's one hundred percent letting seeing what's going to happen in a, in advance. God has a way of of, of, of giving visions. I haven't had one myself. 
Don't, it would be interested, would be overjoyed to get one, but, but, but you've got to be careful also in order to be careful about the things that you ask for because sometimes the things that you ask for, you find out that the things that you can't really handle. But so if God sees fit to give me one, I'm, I'm going to be glad to take it, but I'm also be, be kind of nervous about it too. So, so, so God keeps, in, in the vision, God was communicating, his, God communicates his thoughts and God continues to communicate his minds and God communicates his intentions. It, 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 it may be written, his, his mind, his thoughts and his intentions may be written in, or, as, in, as in his word of, of God. Or it may be spoken as in, in the preacher and the teaching of his word. Or it may be preached as in the preacher teaching and the teaching of his word. Or it may be revealed in visions. Visions. A, 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 a supernatural, a supernatural appearance that, that makes known the future, visions. It's 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 the film of it's 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 knowing about the movie. It's knowing the entire plot of the movie. It's it's, it's seeing the movie uh, from 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 beginning to end. With, and the movie hasn't even been produced yet. Visions, and, that, and and that's what God will do to you when you when you do to you and do with you and do through you and allow you to have in your life when you walk up close to him. Daniel had, Daniel walked close to God and, 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 Dan, and, Daniel, and Daniel had, Daniel had visions. They, 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 it, it was the visions that, that passed on, it was visions that passed on information before the information was even, even thought about. It was it was it was information about what I'm going to do tomorrow morning, and 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 I and I don't even know what I'm going to do tomorrow morning. I haven't even planned tomorrow morning, but it's, but it's, it's the vision that God will give give you or give me about what you're going to do or what's going to happen in this world, a year from now, tomorrow morning, ten years from now. God has ways of pouring out and allowing you to see things. The vision, the, the vision is, is mentioned in, in, in chapter 5, verses, verses five, 5, 5, and, and, and 6. And, 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 and I'm going back to this one because this, again, is one of my favorites. The handwriting on the wall, verses, chapter 5, verses 5, in the same hour came forth the fingers of a man's hand and wrote over against the candlestick upon the plaster of the, of the or wall of the king's palace. And the king saw the part of the hand that wrote. They saw, saw saw something that startled him. The prophetic the fed prophetic message the prophetic message for, for, for the king for, for the new king was just like your daddy. Just like your daddy. Your, da your, your daddy was pompous. Your daddy was proud. Your, your daddy was prideful. Your daddy thought he had it going on. And, and, and your daddy and your daddy made the mistake of making a golden image. You're just like your daddy. You're just like your dad. You're just like your daddy. I took the kingdom away from your daddy, and I'm gonna take the kingdom away from you. That's that's that that's 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 that that was that was the vision. And, 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 and chapter five, verses 20, verses 20, verses five, and that same vision, the five and twenty-eight. Mini, mini, tikel, you separate. This is the interpretation. Meaning, God has numbered the number, number, dikeim, and it's done. You're done. You're finished. You're, it's, it's over. Tikel, thou, thou art weighed in the balance and art found wanting. <laughs> you messed up. You, you, you got beside yourself and you thought you were all that. And, 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 you, and, and you come up lacking of what you thought you really were. The kingdom, Perez, per, 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 the kingdom is, is divided. It's going to be given to the Medes and to the Persian. <laughs> So some somebody somebody else is is, is, is is sitting around you, and somebody else right now is going through a mini mini tico you suffering. Somebody's right now going through that. You've been you 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 you've gotten out far uh, far got far ahead of yourself. You think you're all that in three bags of chips. And God is simply saying to you, and I'm not talking, and I'm not talking about so Jesus help me. This, I'm not talking about somebody that, does not come, that doesn't come to church. I'm talking about somebody who sits in God's house who, who's, who's gotten beside himself. And God is simply saying to you, you found wanting, and, I, and I'm going to have to strip you down and break you down to get you back to where I want you to be. Jesus. It, it, it was in that night that Belshazzar was slain, and Darius took, 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 over, took over as, 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 as king. Daniel's night vision. We shift now to chapter 7. All this is about Daniel's visions, the visions that Daniel was seeing. 
It says in verse, in, 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 in Daniel chapter 7, verses 1 through 8, in the first year of Belshazzar, Daniel had a dream, and, and, and visions passed through his mind as he was lying on the bed, and he wrote down the, the, substance, the substance of his, of, of his dream. I, I was listening to a preacher one, uh, this, this past week, and one of the things that he said was, you need to write it down. Pastor Turner has also said this. You, you need to, whatever God is talking to you, and whatever God is telling you about, and whatever, whatever, you, whatever, you, whatever, you, whatever visions you think God is, is pouring into you, write it down. Write it, put it, put it on a piece of paper. Put it, put it somewhere where you won't lose it because you, you don't know when, that, when that's going to happen, whether it's going to happen today, tomorrow, next week, 10 years from now, if you're still around 50 years from now, you don't know. But, but, but you, get, you get the awesome power, awesome, awesome blessing of picking up that piece of paper and looking at it and saying, ah, oh, this is what God was saying. Uh, Daniel saw four beef, saw the four winds, and and and, and he saw four, saw four great four four great each, each 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 one different from the other. The first one, the first one was like a, a lion, and, and 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 the second one, and the second beast was 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 like a bear, and 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 and, and, the, and the third and the third be, third beast was like a leopard, and 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 and, and, and the and the fourth and, and where's my notes? And and the fourth beast would keep, would keep the fourth beast was like a. a, a uh, uh, the wing had, had wings like a bird. The four feet. Daniel says, "I saw this in, I saw this in the night. I, I, I was, I was, I was asleep." I was resting comfortably, and all of a sudden, this, these visions started coming on, coming on me. The fourth beast, beast was symbolic of the, of, of the throne at, of Rome, and the, the ten horns coming, and 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 and, the, and, and, the, and Rome was going to have ten federations. That was the fourth beast, and and Daniel said, I, 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 I saw all this, and I didn't know what I was seeing. Three points to this lesson. Three points. Verses nine and ten. The shoe is now on the other foot. Verses, verses 11 through 12, lessons learned in being quiet and, let, and letting God do what he does. Five verses, verses, verses 13 and 14, it, it, it's, it's saving the best, saving the best for last. The, the shoe is on the other foot. Why, why, why that thought? Why that thought? Previously, God had given, God had given others' visions that Daniel was called upon to interpret. Daniel now finds himself. Daniel, Daniel, Daniel interpreted for, for Belshazzar. He, he interpreted for Nebuchadnezzar. Daniel had interpreted those dreams for them. But now, but now Daniel finds himself on the other side, and, he, and, he's given, and he's being given visions that he doesn't understand, and somebody's got to interpret it for him. The shoe's now on the other foot. Every now and then, Lord Jesus, every now and then, no matter how gifted a person you think you are, how gifted a person you really are, God will present that person with a situation where, where he is in need of the health, that, of, of, of the very gift that he has himself or she has herself. God has a way of doing things like that. Why? Because every now and then, God's got to remind us, come on down. Come on. Come. Come on, come on, come on down. Come on, come on, come on back down. Come on back down. I, I, I've gifted you. I poured my anointing upon you. I, 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 I've laid my hand on you. I'm using you mightily. But come on down. Because every now and then we can get to thinking that the, I, we, we get to worship in the gift that, uh, that God has given us. And God sometimes has, God has to say, come on down. Has God ever had to tell you to come on down? Been there, done that. Come on down. Come on down. Let's get out of there. Ha, ha, having written down, having written down what he saw, God, 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 Daniel not sat down and revisited and asked God, God, what is all this about? This is where we come. Not, not fully understanding what, what he was seeing. Daniel, Daniel was seeing God's judgment. Verse 15 of, of this uh, 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 past, in, in this past, that's not in this lesson, simply said, Daniel, I, I, Daniel, was grieved in my spirit. I was, I was hurting in my spirit. The visions in my head troubled me. I did not understand them. I, in, 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 in the supernatural, I, in the supernatural, verse 9, in the, in the supernatural, I, I, I saw positions of power cast down in the, the throne. 
I beheld, I, I verse 9, I beheld the thrones were, the, the, the thrones were, were cast out. I, 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 supernaturally, I supernaturally saw God, the ancient of days, God himself in his judgment removed people from their power. Sitting, sit, sitting, sitting calmly on, on, on the seat of judgment. God, God, God can calmly remove a person from power. People get entrenched. Been there, done that too. People get entrenched. Get entrenched, entrenched in the position that they're in. And God simply has a way of, of simply mo- removing you from the position of, 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 of that. Oh, Lord, thank you, Lord, that you call yourself now worshiping the position that you are in. And God simply says to you, I'm, I'm, it's time for me to take, take, bring, you, bring you down. People can become entrenched, and, and, and God simply removed them. I, 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 I beheld. <laughs> Verse 9, I, 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 I beheld. Beheld. To, 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 to see in a vision, a vision, an appearance of something in the mind as a supernatural re- revelation that communicates God's truth. Let me redo that. Let me say that again. A, an appearance in a, an, a, an appearance in the, in, 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 in the mind, a, an, an appearance a, a, an appearance that it comes before your mind, it comes into your eyesight, it comes into you that that reveals that re- reveals the truth of God, and it says, "I, I beheld till the thrones, till the seats, through the through the seats were cast down." To, to, the, to the seats, the, 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 the positions of power were, were cast down, where they, they were dethroned, they were removed. There was the removal of an iron, a, a monarch and the removal of, of, the, of, of the ruler of the nation. It, 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 was, it was a court scene. Court scene. Hear ye, hear ye, court is now in, court is now in, court is now in session. The judge, the judge in verse 9, the judge, the ancient of days was, was sitting, in, sitting in his white robe. White, white symbolizing purity, white symbolizing innocence, white symbolizing righteousness. Not, white symbolizing, there's no dilution, that, uh, and that would cause, the, the, that would cause the, the judge to make an error in his judgment. Every now and then, human judges make errors in their judgment. But God simply says, I, I make no errors. I, 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 I'm, I'm, I'm all powers, all, not all, all power, all, all knowledge, all knowing. I, 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 I make no, 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 no errors. I, I am immutable. I'm the same yesterday and today and forevermore. I, I make no errors. Huh. The ancient, the ancient, it says, says in verse 9 that the ancient of days did sit whose garment was white. If the garment was white, in other words, his clothing was, was pure and it was radiant and it was bright and it was shining and, and, and it was like snowflakes. Snowflakes, snowflakes, snowflakes. His, his, hair, his white hair was, his white hair, the white hair in verse 9 symbolizes wisdom. The, 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 hair, the, the, the hair of his head was, was, was pure. It was, it was clean. It was white. It was free from extended. It, it was like, it was like a, 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 a lamb's wool. God, God, God was sitting on his throne. God's throne and, 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 and God and its wheels were, were ablaze with, with, flaming, with flaming fire, which symbolizes God's justice to be executed as the great, at the great white throne. The great white throne comes out of, 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 out of Revelations 20, 11, and 15. His throne, his throne, his, the, 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 the judge's seat is, 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 is like fiery wheels burning, burning, bur- burning, burning, burning like, burning like, burning like fire. Flowing, 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 flowing out from, from God's holy presence was a river of fire, a, a, a lava, a symbol of his holy wrath to be poured. Go, go get God angry. Pouring out his, his wrath, pouring out upon all the wicked on the earth, in particular upon the little horn. And the little horn in this, in, in this, in this, in this scripture is, is the Antichrist. It says in verse 10, a fiery stream, a, a fire, an extremely stream, an uh, extremely hot stream, a, a, a flame that glowed uh, is issued and it came forth. It, it appeared and it came and it came before him. God's prophetic word, just, God's prophetic word right now to somebody listening is this is not your battle. It's not your battle. What's going on in your life? Who's, who, who are you? Jesus, who are you battling with? Who, 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 are, who are you having mental, mental gyrations about? Who? 
They won't talk to you sometimes. They don't want to speak to you sometimes. They, they make, or, or they make snide remarks about you. Who, 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 who's, go, who, who is, who's going on? Who, who's, who's, getting, who's getting on your nerves? Who's, who, who's getting into your head? Huh? God says, this, this is not your battle. Leave this one alone. That's for somebody. I don't know who. I don't know if they're sitting over there, 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 there. I don't know if they're. The, that's for somebody. It might even be for me. Leave this one alone. <laughs> Let it go. They're, they're, they're <laughs> God simply says, I got this one. This one's mine. You've been faithful. I said faithful, I didn't say perfect. You've been faithful. You've done the best you could. Sometimes you got it right, sometimes you got it wrong. You, 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 you seek my face, you, 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 would like, you would like to walk and you talk with me, you, you, you want to be close to me. I got this. There are times, <laughs> part of our problem is there are times we want to see how God handles it. Why? <laughs> We want to see how God handles it. Why we want to see? God, oh God, I just want to see how you with them. Come on, y'all. Come on, come on, come on. Don't, don't, be real. I, I, God, you, 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 they've been getting on my last nerve, and you know they're not right, God. So, God, I, I, I just want to see how you with them. And God says, shut up. This is not your battle. Uh, the courtroom, the courtroom, the courtroom, verse 10, they're still in verse 10. The courtroom is packed with those who have, who have rightly worshiped God, ready in, in anticipation to watch God handle his business. Thousands, thousands ministered, worshiped him. Tens, thousands, ten thousands stood before him and, the, and, and, and before him. The, the judgment and the judgment was set in place. Not fully understanding, not fully understanding the vision at that time. Daniel watched God open the scroll. Verse 10, and the books, the scroll, the document that was rolled up for storage was open. Information, <laughs> information that was there, God, uh, information was there that only God, only, on, on, God, only God knew. Only God knew. Thoughts, excuse me, thoughts, thoughts, thoughts you had, thoughts, thoughts I had that you thought nobody heard. I, uh, 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 mindsets and, 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 and weaknesses that you thought nobody had, what's done in the dark shall come into the light. Weaknesses that you thought nobody saw but God. And, he, and, and God opened up the book and said, let me see Wesley Thompson. Oh, oh. Mm. Mm. No, didn't get that one right. No, he got that one right. No, I didn't get that one right. Oh, no. oh I see. Well, oh, he's okay. He got the blood coloring. He's all right. He opened up the book. Because the most important thing that God opens up the book to see is, are you covered by the blood? Because if no matter how good you think you are, good you act, if you're not covered by the blood, the blood you got problems. Now that, that, was, that, was, that was point number one. A lesson, point number two, a lesson learned in being quiet and letting God do what he does. How many of you can be quiet and let God do what he does? How many of you can sit down, shut your mouth, and let God do what he does? Daniel was quiet. For, look, for, and, and Daniel was quiet. And, 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 and forwarding to verse, verse 15, Daniel simply said, I'm going to shut up. Verse 15, he says, I'm going I'm I'm to shut up and I'm going to listen and I'm going to watch. I, I'm going to shut up and I'm going to listen and I'm going to watch because I don't understand. Some of us need to take a lesson from Daniel. Shut up. Listen and watch because we don't understand. I beheld, verse 
Was, 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 was it ever? I, 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 I beheld. I beheld. I comprehended it. I comprehended it for the first time. For the first time, I understood what God was saying. Yeah, for the first time, I understood. I, I, I kind of understood what God was doing. There are times when God will give us comprehension and understanding when we shut up. Shut up. So thank you, Lord. Shut up is not just shut up. Not, it's, shut up is not just shut up your mouth. Sometimes it's shut up your mind. Shut your mind down. Quit, shut your mind down. Quit trying, to, quit trying to figure out everything that God is saying and quit trying to figure out everything that God is doing. Shut up. Under, we understand when we shut up, when we listen, when we be quiet and just watch God do what he does. I beheld. I see the vision. I see the supernatural. Good question is asked. Very dangerous question in this season. What's God doing in America in this election? Go out and vote. <laughs> Go out and vote. Vote for the candidate <laughs> that God would put in your heart. <laughs> I rephrase my words quickly. <laughs> that God would put in your heart to be the right to be the right candidate. But if God decides to do something else, shut up and listen and shut up and watch. What's God doing in America? We don't know. We wish we know. There were those who would prophesy about what God is doing. But sometimes I wonder if they really get it from God or is it really what they want to hear, want God to say that they want because it's the agenda that they had in their mind. Daniel just saw, Daniel the saw, saw and described the judgment of the Antichrist, the little horn, and all, and, and all who follow his way. Verse 11, as, as, as Daniel reflected on what he had written down, how, and how he watched and how he listened, I beheld. I, comp I, I comprehended it. I see this for the, for the I'm, I'm seeing, seeing this and trying to understand this from the first, from the first time. Up until the, the very last moment, the little horn, the, the little horn, the Antichrist has spewed out his boastful, defiant, blasphemy, blasphemy for me against God. And, and in verse 11 it says, then, I, then, then, the, because, then because of the voice, the audible voice, the, the, the audible sensation of, of, the, of the great words which the horn has spake out, I, 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 God, God said, Daniel said, I beheld. I heard him. I, I, I paid. I paid. I, I, I paid attention to him. I, I, I watched him boast. But all of a sudden, there's a suddenly. Suddenly. Suddenly, there are some. There are some. There are some. Jesus. There are some suddenly things that God does in your life. Suddenly. Verse ten, eleven. Say, I beheld. I, I, I paid close attention to to the beast, even until the beast was slain. And, and and his body was destroyed. Da Dan Daniel, all of, all of a sudden, Daniel shut up, sat down, and, and and he watched God take the beast and destroy him suddenly. Daniel, the body, the body, that, thank you. The, the body was, was but the body was thrown. It was thrown into a blazing fire. In verse eleven, it says, and was given into to a, bla a blazing, a flaming, an intense fire that 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 glow. Revelation says that the antichrist was cast into the lake of fire and brimstone, and will be tormented day and night. Can you imagine? Can you? Because we 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 haven't got this. We don't we don't understand this thing. We we think that once we die, we're dead, and that's it. No, and it's gone. No, no, your your body, your soul is going to be in torment. For the for the for for eternity. How long is eternity? There's no end. Fire, 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 you, fire keeps burning and there's no end. You, you want the fire to go out and there's no end. Be careful. If, if, this, is, this, was, this is for some unsaved person. Be careful. You need, to get, you, you, need, you, you need to get to know Jesus in the free pardon of your sins because this is no plaything, this thing called hell. Oh, Jesus. 
The other, the other beast, the other beast in, in, verse, in verse 12. The other beast, the, the other beast, the, the, the others who will rule, who, the others who have who are world power that ruled on the earth down to the century, both the, 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 the wicked also will face God's judgment. Nobody escapes. Nobody. You think, you think you're all that in three bags of chips? Nobody. You, you, you think you got away with it? And, God, and God's going to give you a pardon because you, you donated a million dollars to this particular church? Nobody. But you never gave your life to the Lord? Nobody. Can't buy God. Nobody. It says, and concerning the rest of the beasts, they had their dominion. Take, they, their, their power was taken away. And, 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 and the, their authority to rule upon earth was stripped away. And, and yet, it says in verse 12, yet their lives were prolonged for, for a season at a time. They, they, they will be allowed to live, for a, to, to, to live for a season, a period of time. Can you imagine, can you imagine being somebody that's had all, all your life, you had all this power. And all of a gun of sudden God stripped you away, and now you are you have nothing for the rest of your life. And then God allows you to live 10 to 15 or 20 more years. And 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 and, and you and you used to be the man, you used to be the woman. When, when the decision had to be made, they called you and, and you sat down and you thought about it and you folded your house and said, This is what we'll do. And now nobody calls you powerless. They 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 would live the rest of their life. That for, for that for them, even, even before, Lord, thank you, even before, even before the lake of fire, even before they get thrown into the lake of fire, they, they, they go through, a, they go through a, 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 a tormenting time in their life, powerless. Let's get out of here. First, Second Peter chapter 2, verse 9. The Lord knoweth how to deliver the godly out of temptation and to reserve the unjust until the day of judgment, of judgment to be punished. We, 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 we talked about the shoe being on the other foot, and, 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 we, talk, and we talked about uh, 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 quiet times. Uh, just, just shut up and listen. Finally, <laughs> this is the good stuff. Saving the best for last. Saving, saving, saving the best for last. Uh, the last. I have not seen. I have not seen. I have not heard. Neither has it entered to the hearts of men as the things that God had prepared for them that love him. Saving the best for last. Saving, saving the best for the, for the, for the greatest in, anticipation. Uh, the, save, save, saving the best for that. The, the, the Son of Man, the Son of Man entered the throne of God in the magnificent clouds of heaven, verse 13. And, and, and I, saw, I saw in the night, in, in the time, in, 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 in the, between, mid, between, between the sunset and, and the morning light, I saw visions. I, I, I saw supernatural appearances made known. I, I, I got your message, God. It says that the Son of Man is, 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 is Jesus Christ. And, and, and it says, the Son of man means that Jesus Christ is not, the, is not an ordinary man. He is a son of a man, but he is, he is God. He's God. He, he, is, he is the ideal man. He is, he is the man of, of excellence. He is the representative of a man, a man who represents others well, represents himself and others well. He is the perfect, he is the perfect man. He is the consummate, he is complete man. He, 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 is, the, he is the pattern, pattern of a man. He is the, he is the embodiment of, of, of a man. He, he, is, he has personality. He is everything a, a man ought to be. Jesus Christ is the perfect man. You want to be like somebody, you ought to want to be like Jesus. Everything God wants a man to be is perfectly seen in the man named Jesus. Verse 13. When, 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 Daniel, when Daniel saw this person coming in the clouds of heaven, he was indicating that the person, that person was coming out of heaven and coming to earth. Ah, there's, coming, there's going to come a day when he comes back to get you. He go, he, in verse 3, he, he's, going, he, he's, coming, he's, come, he's coming, Jesus. He's, he's, coming, he's coming in the clouds. He was he was in he, he was in heaven with the ancient of days with God his father but but he but now he, he's he's gonna be, he's he says he he came to the ancient of days and, and they brought him before brought him near in other words he's he's coming back he daddy I'm coming back now 
God our Father, I'm coming back now. I'm going back to earth. I'm going to get, I'm going to get those who I died for, who I shed my blood for. I'm going to get them, and I'm bringing them back to you. <laughs> it's, 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 a, it's, it's a dramatic scene. Daniel, Daniel saw the son of man approach the ancient, ancient of days, and, and, and when he comes back, he says that he, he receives an eternal, uh, uh, the, uh, the reward of an eternal dominion over, over people and all. The, in other words, uh, all, all power, all, he, gets, he, gets the, he gets the glory of the throne and the, and the, and the presence and the, and the blessing of heaven, all power. He always has had it. But now he's getting the crown. In verse, in verse 14a, it says, the honor is due. And there was given him dominion and glory and kingdom uh, and, that, uh, and all, uh, that all people and nations and languages should serve him. I'm done. I'm, 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 I'm done. The Son of Man. The Son of Man will rule a kingdom that will always be. You will always be in eternity. The Son of Man will, will rule in a kingdom that will never be destroyed. You and I will live in a kingdom <laughs> that will never be destroyed. Daniel prophesied about the Son of Man. God, I thank you for this lesson. Praying, Father, that something was said through your Holy Spirit, that will touch somebody's life, cause them to make the change that they need to make in their life. Help us, Father, to learn how to be quiet. How to be quiet. And how to listen and what and watch and see what you do. That in the end, your goodness and his and your mercy has followed us all the days of our lives on earth. And now for the remaining of it, for the remainder of eternity, it will be we will be with you in heaven. We honor you, we thank you, we give you glory in Jesus' name. Amen.